well. The US Masters T10 Global charges into day six. We are so excited for what's on offer today. Go! The weather is looking fantastic once again, which means we have three of Cricket's fastest format in store for you. Up first though, it's the Morrisville Unity taking on the Texas Chargers and Dominic Cobb, who joins me to chat through what we can expect today. Well, they're both off a win, so you know, the confidence will be riding high. And who does it bring up against? It brings up Universe Boss standing there, still hitting it down the ground, up against Fidel Edwards, hat-trick hero, West Indian versus West Indian. Then we have Ovis Pienaar, the left armer, swing it back in, runs, wickets, up against Hafiz, the professor, Look Looks lovely, dresses nicely, hits down the ground. Cannot wait for this game. I want to see him bowl. We haven't even seen no. him yet because the Texas Chargers bowling depth is so long that, you know, Ben Dunk's well, oh, I got seven bowlers. Who do you want to see? Don't need him. Don't need him. He only got six for four in Zimbabwe in the T10, but we don't need him. We're too good for that. Can't wait for that first game. Yeah, it's going to be an absolute blockbuster. That is game one of today's triple header. <laughs> Well, match two brings all the superstars to the yard. That's right, I'm talking about Aaron Finch, Jacques Callis. Oh my gosh, there's just so many names on this side today. And, and California Knights, well, they started off brilliantly. They've lost the last couple. They need to pick up momentum. And you know, you're up against a team that's riding high. The New York Warriors, fantastic win in the last match of yesterday. And you think about the matchups, these are so good. Callis, Grace, Suresh Rain, a beauty at times in the field is excellent. Finch. Power down the ground, 250s in his last two knocks, but he's up against guess who? Oh, the boom boom, Afridi, who just wants to hit you. He may bowl, Misbah Hall will hack as well. And don't forget, Sahail Khan, hat trick hero. Who will win that, Joe? Who knows? It's match two, it doesn't get any better. It absolutely doesn't. All to play for today for the California Knights. And well, the New York Warriors, they'll be looking to continue that winning feeling. Well, Game 3 brings the Atlanta surfboard riders, I'm going to call them, because they literally keep having rain in every game. Fresh off a loss while they're up against the New Jersey Tritons, who also bolted yesterday. So this truly is a must-win game for both sides, but in particular, the Atlanta riders, they have to find a way. It's... Robin Utapa up mm. the front, he's been great with the bat, but he just can't get his team across the line. Absolutely. Him and Lendl Simmons, they are powerful down the ground. We know that Robin Utapa to do. We saw him in, in Zimbabwe. Lendl Simmons is a fine player. They're up against Liam Plunkett, though. Don't forget the Englishman, the UK, man from UK who's now moved to the USA with those slower balls. Can't wait for that. And the left arm spinners as well. Sunny, Ampri, all them coming in. It's going to be a classic. If it's anything like this last three and yesterday, can't wait for match three. Well, if it's anything like yesterday, the bowlers really came to the fore. And really, you know, one of the deciding factors in pretty much all the matches yesterday. So plenty to think of for both of those sides as they come off those losses yesterday. But it truly is going to be an exhilarating day of cricket here in the US Masters Global T10. I'm excited, you're excited, high five it. Come on the bowlers! <laughs>